Hello and welcome to this session on what is Kiko driver. Today we will learn what is Kiko, what is Kiko driver and why does Selenium needs Kiko driver. Let us begin. So Kiko is a web browser engine which is developed by Mozilla Foundation written in C++ and is open source. Let us understand what is a web browser engine. So web browser engine is a software program that is used to control and render the content on the browser and therefore it is also known as layout engine or rendering engine. If you look at this picture, we have a user interface at the top and this is where the user interacts with the browser and at the bottom we have the backend components. In the middle we have the browser engine and the rendering engine which is used to control and render the content on the browser and this is exactly where Geeko browser engine fits into picture. You can also go to this website and you can read about the Geeko web browser engine. These are some uh, very popular browsers and these are the web browser engines used by these browsers. You can also go to this Wikipedia page web browser engine and they have some really good information about all these web browser engines. You can actually look at this timeline graph where all the web browsers are there and what is the time they were introduced and what is the current uh, situation. So there is another Wikipedia page which is comparison of web browser engines. Here again you will find some really good and deep information on web browsers. So you can see these are the web browser engines and these are the programming languages. Then you can look at the release history of these engines and the operating system support. Let us now understand what is Kiko driver. So Kiko driver is a proxy which is used to interact with the browsers that run on Kiko browser engine. So it is used to interact with browsers that are Kiko based like Firefox. And why does Selenium needs Kiko driver? Let us understand this. Until Selenium 2, we had Firefox driver and we used to interact with the Firefox browser using this Firefox driver. Now, with version 48 onwards, Firefox has done some changes and due to some security reasons, it does not allow any third party driver to directly interact with the browser. So you cannot use Firefox driver of Selenium 2 to interact with the Firefox browser after version 47. And therefore we need Selenium 3, which has Marionet driver. And with this, you can directly interact with Firefox browser using a proxy, which is our Kiko driver. So you have also seen in our last session, we have created this program and we have first used Selenium 2 and then we have used Selenium 3. So as of now, it has Selenium 3. If I run this, I will say run as Java application. You can see it will now invoke the Firefox browser. It will go to the website seleniumhq.org and once the website is loaded it will close the browser okay so you can see this has done uh, open the browser and close the browser and if you look at the logs you can see this is actually calling the marionette driver and even if you go to although we have used firefox driver if you go to the implementation you will actually find that it is forcefully calling the marionette driver here Okay, and we can also actually replace the Firefox driver with Marionet driver. So what I have done is instead of calling the Firefox driver, I'm calling the Marionet driver now. And let me again run this. I will do a right click. I will say run as Java application and it is again calling the browser opening the browsers going to the seleniumhq.org website and then it will close the browser okay so uh, even if we call the Firefox driver it will in turn call marinate driver so this is the change with selenium 3 and this is how and why we need a uh, Kiko driver 
in selenium now you can download the latest version from here of the Geekwood driver and we have seen this in our earlier sessions also let us look at what is marionette driver so marionette driver is an automation driver for mozilla's geeko engine and uh, you can go to this website where you will find information about marionette and you can also go to the documentation page and if you search for the marionette driver you will get it here and if i go here it will show me the details of this class so marionette driver is a class and you can see this this is an implementation of the web driver interface that drives firefox using marionette interface okay so this is what marionette driver is let us do a very quick recap today we looked at what is geeko geeko is a web browser engine we looked at what is geeko driver geeko driver is a proxy which is used to interact with browsers that use web browser engine as geeko browser engine and then we looked at why selenium needs geeko driver i hope this session was very useful to you thanks for watching